Welcome back, heroes, to some more Dragon Quest Monsters The Dark Prince. Last episode, we took down three big hitters in the upper echelon. Today, we're heading to the Cradle of Corruption, the upper level, which is the hardest level so far. Four and a half uh, stars, or evil faces. So, let's head down there and see how tough this uh, this place is going to be. I haven't done any grinding since last episode, because I was going to, but I just thought... I think we're pretty strong right now. And if we do need to do some grinding, I'll obviously do some more. But I think... For the time being, we are going to be absolutely golden. Especially with our uh, new healer, the Omni Heal. It's just so... It feels so OP, like we never die. <laughs> so, let's see how this goes. Because last time we came here in the middle level, that boss battle was insanely difficult. And I'm betting we're going to have like a, another tough battle here as well. Is this the place where you said Estark awoke? Yes, and it was his awakening that connected the Cradle of Corruption to Mammon Mine, in our world. So that's how the hero managed to find Estark and defeat it before it recovered its full powers. There's something else. The affinity of the Trinity believe that Estark is actually three gods in one. Three gods? But there's only one Estark here. What are they talking about? Unless this means we've got more than one to deal with in there. Oh, I like the sound of that. This place looks sick though. Look at this, man. I'm down to uh, take down some more gods. We're going to quickly break the pots as well. Just in case we can get a mini medal. I need to head to the mau mausoleum soon. Even though we're not, you know, any B ranks or higher, I think I might try and take down the B rank tournament just because I feel like I'm strong enough now. Ooh. Mega medicine's always good. Well, let's head inside. Do a dungeon to go through, or is it straight to a boss battle, I wonder? Okay, got a dungeon. Right, throne room's just up ahead. Uh, I'm going to see how tough these enemies are. But it doesn't look like we can explore, actually. I think we might just head straight to the throne room. Uh, oh, they're faster than me. I mean, oh, spell prevented. That kind of sucks. And they're D rank? No. Huh. That's fine. Can we get you? Ah. Oh. I'll just fight you then. We should be fine though. Like, we got two heavy hitters with normal attacks. That's a healer. I'm not going to expect him to do big damage. Oh, 402 of a critical hit. Oh, ah, oh, missed. I mean, still good damage there though. And go on. One left. Oh, dude. This accuracy down really sucks. But at least we're doing big damage. I mean, our damage dealers are doing damage. Come on, like one. Oh, frenzied state. Sweet. There you go. How much experience do we get? It's not too bad. Level up is nice. I have to fuse that, um... Zap Lizard, just because... Oh, wait, I think we have to go around to get to the throne room. It's just wasted talent points at this point. Uh, anything even up here? Got some pots. Come on, mini medals. Hey, there we go. <laughs> I think I have about... Five to hand in now. Maybe a little bit more. I bet there's a chest in that corner. Because why else would you make me go all the way around from up here? Oh, dude's jumping. Yeah, I can see the chest. I can see the chest. I knew it. Oh, can jump out like that. I see ya. Just like the... Oh, there's two chests. Perfect place to put a chest, man. Make a way you can't go up and then put a chest on the other end. So you have to run all the way around. And that dude's going to jump out at me. So I have to be a little bit careful and I, okay. 
Unless I think I can squeeze through here. I don't mind fighting. We'll absolutely destroy everyone. Nice. It's nice when you just keep going for AoE attacks and you just take down everyone. Oh, nice, great. Saber Cat grow another level. Uh, let's check the talent points. Uh, I've only got nine for you. I mean, puts your max HP up by four. I'll take that. Every little helps at this point. Especially when we're fighting a god. All right, so what we got? Got Devil's Advocate Scroll. The scrolls are nice. I need to save them on for like when we get our final like team. There's no point like putting it on someone and then just fusing and then losing it. Unless I bring it over. I don't know what, you know. Ooh. Gonna want to have in the future. But to the throne room. Until the, the spooky, dark, evil mist. I love the look of the temple, though. Is this the Lord of the Underworld? Yes, I think you're right. This must be where the hero defeated it. But it's just a stone statue. Crazy to think this thing almost destroyed the world. Let's press on, see what else we can find. It looks so sick. Hey, old buddy. There's the petrified form of Estark defeated by the Chosen. So cool. There's a door back here. Oh, that's where we have to go. Or unless we're going down that way. Let's go through here. The Temple of Venger. Oh, we got some cool mods. If we can scout some of these, that'd be kind of awesome. I feel like we're not going to be able to do it. Unless we get lucky. The monster riding a dragon. It's like two for one. Still rank D though. How are these like not rank C in here? Just for the difficulty of the uh, of the area, the ranks would be higher. We have yet to see a rank B in this game. Like I can't even like fuse anything, even like my best stuff into a rank B. Oh, critical hit, nice. Friday night is just going in with the crits, unless it's learned the move that you know is a crit or a miss. Breath defense is nice as well. For like when we battle a boss that has breath attacks. I think this team right now I've got is just. It's the team, you know? <laughs> it's so good. Uh, oh, chest there. So we have to go up and around. You don't want to fight me. And if you do, you want to get caught. That's fake. 100%. Yep, told you. I knew it. <laughs> this has got to check just in case. Just in case. So if we go down here and grab that chest. Is there a chest in that corner? I don't see one. Oh, man. You think you can just, like, get away from them, but they just clip you. Come on, big AoE attacks. I need to put on my mana. Or MP, it's just, uh, yes, yeah, it's at nine. <laughs> I'll do it in a sec. Actually, it depends how... I'm going to wait till next battle. I want to see how close I am to leveling up. I'm probably not that close, but just in case. So I want to just save my, uh, my MP recovery stuff. Come on. Finish it off. There you go. And how close we to leveling up. Please be pretty close. I mean, that's actually... That's fairly close, actually. Like, what? Maybe two more battles? I'll just hold out a little bit longer. All right, yeah, I think we want to go up and around. Like, I don't see a chest. Oh, 
I can get behind if you're quick enough. I'm, just gonna kill. I'm not going to try and recruit him. It's going to kill him. Oh, nice dude. He's in Crit City today. He just keeps getting all the crits. Fright Knight, you are like easily my best monster, I think. And just to think that was, uh, that was the large one we got for doing the middle layer of the Circle of Indulgence. That's one we got for free, and then we I fused it into something else to make a smaller version, and it's just been... It's been insanely good. Alright, no chest, but let's go up the stairs. What we got up here? Oh, another throne room. in there. Though it doesn't look too inviting. Well, shall we? Let's go. Doesn't look too inviting. This whole place doesn't look too inviting. <laughs> Temple of Isma. So lots of different names and I'm guessing just Go through here to another throne room. Uh, how are we getting up? Oh. Alright. So, there's definitely going to be a boss battle going past this bit. 100%. Oh, chest. Let's go and grab that. I think I'll quickly TP back once I, um... Get to the, uh, teleporter just so we can be fully healed. Although, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll get fully healed because the MP for Saber Cat's getting weak as well. Good, good. You're going to fizzle me and you're going to miss on free. <laughs> oh, we're dodging so many attacks as well. Sweet. And that should hopefully grow Fright Knight to 52. Fantastic. One little extra level before we get into the, uh, I say final boss, but like the, the boss. Final one of the locations we've got left to do. Is there a chest up here maybe? Oh, that's so bait. Alright, let me go and uh, get healed up. And then we'll head on up. Alright, so I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, we're fully healed. Let's go for it. Please don't be too difficult. <laughs> I'm very curious to see what it's going to look like. We've seen something like this in the middle section of the Cradle of Corruption. Whoa, now! What the...? Trinity, Trinity, we've got an affinity! Find our divinity and we're in the vicinity! Trinity, Trinity, we've got an affinity! Measure our faith, it's bigger than infinity! And with that, we conclude the most awe-inspiring rendering of the supreme truth of the universe that has ever been attempted! Felicity to the Trinity! <coughs> We stand now on the 
the cusp of cataclysm. Isma of the Unholy Trinity shall awaken! Damn, this looks so much more terrifying than the other one. Looks sick though. Alright, uh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? I'm gonna... First, see if we can just put down... Uh, your def... Actually, let's go for... Where is it? This one. Have some bad medicine. And we missed. <laughs> Ooh, that put your tank down though. And critical hit, sweet. Damn, my team up to a great start. Ooh, that does a lot. I'm gonna try again with the bad medicine. Here. Music here is kind of badass. Oh, I missed again. I wonder if I can't actually land it. It said strong. I hover over it, but I'm not sure that means like strong chance of missing now. <laughs> I thought it meant like strong effectiveness against it. Oh, that put a lot of my stuff down. Alright, let me try one more time. If this misses, then I'm just gonna have to leave it. Nope, okay. Not lying on that, we'll just leave it. Oh, he's going for my healer. Cheeky, man. Look at that Omni heal. Woo, everyone back to Fleet Pee. Nice. Uh, in that case, what we'll do is, uh, we'll just try this. There you go. That works. Maybe we're we'll just getting lucky with the defense, de uh, or the bad medicine. Attack down. Okay, that's fine. As long as it doesn't stop me from using my moves, that's all that matters. So I can just go for Omni Heal and nice, good damage. Uh, I am gonna get some MP back though. Uh, MP, MP, MP. Let's go for some Mystic Water because you haven't got much MP to even use at the moment. It's breaking wind, quick! Cover your noses. Don't smell it. Smell it, dealt it. Nice, multi fist, pretty good. Boom! Ooh, okay. Alright, uh, gonna just use this, get some more MP again. Ouch, it's fine. Omni Heal will come in, fully heal us. See, that's why I didn't want to do much grinding, just because Omni Heal just feels so OP. Super OP. Just gonna attack. Oh, Frenzy State, nice. Estark, you do not stand a chance, my dude. That's essentially, I've got six attacks per turn now. Because Friday Night attacks twice, and now with Cyber Cat and the Frenzy State, that's two attacks there. This is actually really good. Boom! Yeah, take that one damage. <laughs> Nice, and then again. Probably should up the NP just because I feel like you'll be attacking quite a few times now. But no, my like, oh, you're in a frenzy state. That's, that's not good. That is really not good. <gasps> okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I can revive it. Oh, this just got really bad. I'm hoping I kill it really soon. Okay, uh... We'll go... Oh, to the whole party? Oh, that's even better than I thought. Okay. In that case, I'm just gonna... Wait another turn. 
So that's actually bad. I didn't. Think, I thought it was just like gonna be one enemy, well, one ally, but whole team. Nice. Yeah, you do that heal. All right, should I go for it now. Yeah, let's go for it. Then you don't stand a chance. Not sure how long the frenzy state lasts for, but hopefully yours. Uh, oh, put it, actually put it to sleep. Ooh. I don't know what the odds are of that, but... Damn, son. It's actually kind of insane. I don't think you can put the bosses to sleep in this. Must be like very, very low odds. Oh, critical 360 damage. That was good. Oh, there's no way you're like going to be living much longer. Ooh, it's fine. You're not in a frenzy state no more. That item we had was so powerful. Gosh, should I save it for like a final boss though? Come on, keep going. Boom! This thing's actually really tough. I feel like I've done so much to it. I feel like any second now, so it's got to just drop dead. Ha! <laughs> you missed. And then back to full HP, thank you very much. Ooh, tack down, sweet. Hey, there we go! Ooh! The frenzy state it went in was a little bit... Oh, 30,000 experience, nice. Was a bit scary, but... Look at the item. I've really saved the day. Is this thing what I think it is? If you mean, is it one of the unholy trinity? Then yes, it certainly resembles the one we saw earlier. I knew it! So there are three versions of Estark. Well, we've beaten two so far. So where could the last one be hiding? Hmm. I think the best thing now would be to return to Rose Hill. Oh, that's not creepy. That's not creepy at all. Man, you got absolutely destroyed, son. Alright, so let's go back to Rose Hill Tower. And then we can start planning and maybe... Hmm, the next area might actually have B ranks. <laughs> I feel like we're getting to get close to the end of the game now, surely. In the slow, fading beauty of a freshly picked flower, I remember all I lost since you left my side. Long time no see. You? But how? Surprised to see me? Well, we haven't met since our fraternal squabble in the circle of conquest after all. him from the retention center wait what does he mean fraternal squabble a lot happened while you were gone what he's your little brother uh, it's good to see you again a little bird told me that your reputation has spread to pretty much every corner of nadiria <laughs> oh Nothing gets past me. Right now, you're looking for someone, aren't you? Here, you'll need this. Oh, 
can't believe he's still alive. I thought he was like gone, gone, gone. That should take you where you want to go, straight to where Armin is hiding. I have to go now. Until we meet again. Sunset marks the dying day and makes way for nightly dreams that evaporate as mist in nascent sunrise. Alright. One's being fully healed. Sweet. Let's go check this area out. If it's too difficult, we can obviously just do some grinding first. Not an issue. But I love all the colours of the travel light just like going around. The more we add to it, it just looks so sick. Don't know how many more we're going to be getting, but... Just the more we add to it. Ah, so cool. Right, reach Rose Hill, place this. Location is available to visit. Sweet. So we have this place in the circle of Caprice. It's five, uh, five scary heads. <laughs> so this is like max strength you can get. Surely, surely we can find at least a B rank here. Really starting to feel like B rank and higher. We're not going to get to a post game. Or maybe you have to fuse for it. That's what it's really starting to feel like. Let's go check this place out. First it was all like watery, looked really beautiful. Then it was all sandy. And now it's all... Snowy maybe? <gasps> Snowy! <laughs> is here somewhere. I don't exactly trust Ludo, but it's the best lead we have right now. Let's give him the benefit of the doubt. Now, could Armin be in that temple? Well, no use standing around. I think we owe someone a little payback. Yeah, I don't trust Ludo after the last time. No thanks, but ooh, you look cool. How tough are you? I'm hoping you're gonna be... Oh, there! Enemies as well. <gasps> A B rank! Oh my god, we found our first B rank! Oh, come on, please let me get you. Oh my god, we got our first B rank! <laughs> finally! Finally, 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 a snowbird. Right, uh... Gonna replace you. So I wanna quickly just put you with you like that. Probably should have Fuego on for the, the battle against um S Dark, but you look kinda cool as well. You, are you B rank? Oh with B ranks around here I can probably catch quite a few and just like upgrade our ranks. Another B rank! Yeah. Yes! Come on, be cool, be cool. Right, I'm gonna try to use one of these meats. That's fine, all right. Uh, slightly increase, uh, very slightly increase. So, very slightly. Uh, I'll give you a mystery meat. Ha! Loved it. Didn't go up by much. I oh, know, I can't get it. <laughs> oh, maybe like it might join us after the fight. It's always a possibility. Oh man, I'm going to be doing so much fusion. After we like finish this area, so we'll get the rep up and then I can go around, keep catching B ranks, upgrade what we got, and then our team next episode will be banging. 
B for banging. <laughs> oh, it's good to actually see some B ranks though. Now, I do wonder if there's an S rank. I thought there probably will be. Nice, oh, we do so much damage. XP's not too bad either. Alright, so we probably just. I don't know if we can jump across that. Let's go this way. Although, I'm actually. Is this a snowy place or is it a watery place but it's just frozen over because we're in an icy. Air, like the ice time? Didn't notice that. At first, I thought it was going to be like an icy area, but now I think it might be a watery area. I mean, it depends on how long it takes us to get to the temple, the time of day might change. Or time of season. Alright. Oh, this is a large one! Yeah. Oh, I kind of want to get this 6%. I don't know if I'm going to get you. Uh. Let's try. Now. 5%? There's no way I get you a 5%, yeah. Oh man, we're still gonna get that as a large. And if I could like fuse that into something to make it like a small, like we're done with Fright Night and it gets attacked twice. Oh, you got revive? Oh, damn. That's actually really good. Oh, you're dead again. Did not know you had revive. This dude is actually insane. Oh, wow, that's a lot of damage with critical hit. Again, Fright Night, what's up with the critical hits you're getting? I mean, don't stop, please. But you're getting so many. So good. All right, I think I'm gonna wait until we finish this area off. Then I've got, I've got to come back get some, so I can try do some. Oh, oh! Oh, you look so cool. Yeah, try do some scouting after. Ooh! Looks sick. Gonna get you. Gonna get you. Gonna get you as well. I'm gonna just fuse everything in. Ooh! Can I easily get across because it's uh, ice weather? What if I don't even jump up? There's no way I could be a bit cheesy, right? <laughs> Can you imagine? Yeah, I can't jump up that way, so we'll have to go a different way. Uh, maybe from that side? Whee! Oof! <laughs> yeah, it says, oh, it can't go from there. But while it's frozen over, let's go get that chest because we can't get it otherwise. All right, what we got? What we got? Refrigerator scroll. How do we get across? Because that's broken as well. I want to see how I get. Oh, egg, 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 egg. Come on, be something good, man. Be something good. Please be something good. Oh, it's gold. Oh my god. What does that mean? What does it mean? Is when it went gold? It's a C rank. It's good, but. What does it mean? It went gold. Does that mean like it's just a rarer egg? Oh, that's sick. Anything in this? Ooh, that's actually not bad. I'm so confused what that meant, but I'm happy I, I managed to do something. Uh, up we go. Unless I can... Oh no, that's, that's connected. I can't wait, I can't get across because that bit, bit of bridge is broken. Unless we can jump it. Ooh. Just keep going up. Oh, there's a lot of dudes around here. <gasps> never egg, never egg. Stay asleep. Come on, go gold again. <gasps> to that. 
I went, ooh. Is that silver platinum, maybe? I'm so confused at what's going on, but what we got? D rank, I mean, it's, it's okay. At least a C would be nice. All right, so we climb up. And can we even get across here? I can't get across. Oh. Where am I going? As I can get round up here, it doesn't look like it. Let me break this. And this. Like. We can't get across because. That's broken. I must be missing something. Maybe the back right corners? Might be a way up. Look like it might be possible to jump up from the left side as well. So let's go to the far right. Yeah, because we can go up from there. I think. It's, so far, this place has been banging. Oh, once we get the upgrade. It's going to be so sick. Oh, let's go across here because we can. Is that a chest I see in the background? We haven't got long till uh, seasons change. Oh, dude, I don't want to fight you. Oh, let's see, check what rank you are, but I think we're going to end up killing you. Oh, we need to get healed up. Come on, Omni Heal. There you go. Sweet. Omni Heal is so OP. And I felt like every turn, end of every turn, we get MP back. It's so good. Oh, we're getting a lot of experience around here as well. I might just do some grinding. Because that last boss was pretty tough. Can never hurt. A better bestie bites. Okay. Yeah, I think we want to go up this bit. I think. <laughs> oh, this is so confusing. So where is this taking us? Yeah, this is this is it, right? This is where we want to go, because that leads on to that. But if we go back down towards where we were just up, up a second ago, we can get that chest. Which is... Oh, I don't think I can even jump across that, no. Might be a different season, because I can't jump up. Ooh, as we saw before, I had to jump down. There's a lot of enemies around here. I don't mind fighting you. I'd rather fight you when I can recruit you. Because I'm going to get a bunch of bees. A bunch of bees and I'm going to fuse a lot. Oh, season changes. So there you go. See, I like it when it's like got the music playing like this. Oh, it looks so much better. It looks insanely beautiful. I wish that like the... um. The frozen areas had music playing. All right. Oh, you're not even bait. That's good. But oh, look at that. I look sick. It's actually a really nice area. Oh, let's go smash those pots. Then you get this bit right here. That's not not the nicest. From a distance it is. Alright, in we go. To the tempo. Let's try to find Armin then, shall we? Oh, this is looking... This is looking a bit confusing. What are we doing? It looks like it'll be raising water levels to make paths appear. That's fine. So we've got a water temple. Not everyone's favorite. But honestly, I, I, 
I don't really mind Water Temples too much. Kind of love them in Zelda. <laughs> These puzzles are really interesting. Don't like the monsters too much, but the aesthetics are always kind of pleasing, and then the puzzles are always kind of fun. Yeah, get that heal that we definitely don't need. We're gonna just destroy, man. So we, I think when I do the fusion, unless like the four we got right here go into something really big, I think I'm gonna probably save these four and then just fuse to the other four, hoping that um, they can just become higher rank and then we can grind them up. Just take you out. Nice. And then one more. Oh. Hey. I do wanna try and keep Fright Night. As it is, though, because it's so, so good. Got some talent points. What can we put in? Uh, yeah, I'm going to try and get that max because so close. That sniper is going to be so cool. I can't do any with Zap Tile because it's, <laughs> it's maxed out. Right, so how do we get across? We can jump, no, never mind. No, uh, this goes across. I thought this bit here was uh, blocked off. Right, uh, we can go up this way. Might be a good idea to try and get the map completed first. Oh, let's break these. And nothing, man. Oh, that's so, oh, hello. How do you do? Baleen Mage. Why does it look kind of cool? <laughs> get a little broom face. Nice, good damage as well. Oh, we need some MP on Fright Night. I'll check how much experience he's got first before we pop some uh, MP recovery items. Last one, he's asleep. To have a nice little nap and then kabuff. Come on, please, Fright Night, be close to leveling up. Oh, there you go. Fantastic. <laughs> That's why I didn't want to pop any MP recovery. Oh, this is so sick. Right, it's just up there. Let's go and grab that. Oh. I feel like this dungeon is going to be super annoying, you know? So how? Okay, not this way. I've got to find a way to raise the water first. Can I get across and do it here? Right, so this should raise the water. I'm good. Oh, I'm going to assume I probably have to bring the water everywhere with me to the end. Because the way it rotated, I feel like some of the things you just have to get every single bit, make the path, get to the end and unlock the door. Nice. The good thing is the enemies around here aren't hard to beat, so if we do end up getting to lots of fights, we just get some free experience, really. I mean, 2500 is still not the best, to be fair. Maybe I should pop the orb. Next 25 battles, get 5k. Is that... Yeah, that's raised, so I can go and do this. Is that going to raise the water over there, or is that going to lower it? I think we want to raise it higher, because we want to get across there. We could just jump across, but that's going to rotate... Oh, that way. Okay. Is so that still pouring in? I just see a chest. I did not. Uh, there's a chest there, though. That's from the other side. 
so that's there. We need do we need both water sources to come down here? Am I able to hit this again? Does it rotate? Or is it just like a one rotation thing? Okay, so it keeps rotating. Right, so that's now here. Can I walk across this? Nice. I'll rotate this. Wait a second. Now I can't get across. Ah. Right. Do we have to do that one second then? Alright, so let's put this back. This is gonna be long. Alright, do that again. And again. Alright, so now that bit's open for us to go through. Yeah, it's gonna take some proper thinking. Roll the sleeves up, it's time to focus. Ain't gonna be an easy breezy one. So if we get this rotated 180, that would go down onto there, and we go back the way we came, rotate that, that should put the middle bit open for us. Sweet, let me go back. Ooh, not today. <laughs> Do this. Alright, so that's open. We can go down the middle. Hey, first section done. <laughs> this is going to be a big, big temple. Okay, so where are we taking the water? Oh, we got some new enemies here. I'm just going to go down first to check where we have to bring all this. So the boss room is there. That's what we need to get into. Right, so we need to bring the water down to the bottom. And there's a lot of switches. Okay. How are we going to do this? So we need to get the water flowing over there. Probably can't just get away with doing this right away, but I'll, I'll give it a go. Oh, chest. Go and get that. Come on, be something cool, be something cool. Three pouches of seasoning. Ooh, nice. Make that meat flavored pretty well. This should, I think, raise the bottom a little bit. Oh, wait, that's in the wrong way. That's not what I was thinking. I need to do the other one. So one more time. I can't get across there, no, so... Can I get across this way? No. If we can lower the water, we can go across, which I think we might have to do. And the other side, that's none that's connected. Might be easier to start with this side then. Here we can rotate this. That drains that bit, which we might be able to get the chest with then. A 
Oh no, we can't get across that. Uh... Right, so we rotate that. That's going to go fall into that bit. The same as the other side. And the water's flowing down. Oh. We just need to get the back ones rotated. But I don't know. I can't see how to get over there. So a way to get this down. Uh, oh, I can jump across here. That's fine. That's actually good. That's good. Alright, we'll fight this dude. It's one of them puzzles, like, if you mess up a little bit, you have to basically reset everything. Got to get in the right order. Which is fun. I like the ground puzzles. But when you got monsters trying to attack you at the same time, it's just it's a little frustrating. <laughs> but we can just destroy them pretty quick. Right. So if we rotate this. It's not high enough yet. We need the other side. But I, I can't get across then. How do I... Oh, I'm missing something. Nice. Oh, I think I know what I have to do. Right, okay. So, we're gonna have that pointed that way in a bit. We need to stop the water going down. We're gonna basically turn everything on from the, the top. Basically, we need to turn everything off, have it set up from bottom to top, turn it on from the top, and then we go from there. Because we need to be on this middle bit to get across. So if I do this first, so we turn you off. This side's pretty much done. It's the other side we need to try and figure out. That's the hard bit. So I don't know how to get across. I might have to like proper turn everything off first. But now we've done that. I'm gonna go back across. And turn this on. I figured it out. Just I figured it out doesn't mean I can do it just yet. <laughs> Alright, so this has got to go... Uh, 270? Oh. And then another 90. Because like, obviously we need that water to be coming through here, but there's literally no way to get across. But now we're on this side, and we set the water from the top, it goes down, and that's already set up, and we're good. But I think we need to stop the water down there to get up from that side. So I think I, I see where I, how I do this. I just need to stop the water flow. So can I do that? I don't know if I can even get across, actually. Like, I need to stop this uh... Ooh, chest oh, don't, I think I need to do I just up the water in the middle as well If I do, that's going to make things a little bit more difficult. I mean, it's doable. Uh, 
can't go that way. I need to find a way back. I'm really starting to think I have to. There's no way. Unless that stops that whole area. So let's do this. Oh, because now that's done that, now I can get back across. I see. Oh, uh, actually, do I see? I think I have to turn the middle off. Because if I can't get across down the bottom, which I'm fairly certain I can't, there's too much water here. I'm hoping it'll be like a puddle length I can just walk across. Yeah, it's too high. Right, okay. So we have to figure the way out. Uh, oh no. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll shut off the water in the middle here. Hopefully we can come back from the top left. Then after that, I can get to the one at the, uh, the well, obviously facing the, the way we need to go, turn around. That right side, I, okay, I, I know what I have to do, I know what I have to do. Just gotta try and get to it. So, was it turning that one off first? I think, yeah. Oh no, maybe I can just get away with going around? Is that connected? I think it might be fine. Alright, so we want to put this up real quick. Ooh. So that's going to stay up. We are going to go turn this one off. Doesn't matter where we turn this, honestly. We're going to do it three times just so it saves time when we come back and flip the switch later. This is a really cool puzzle, man. I, I like this. So that's set up for when we come back. Do so you want to try and figure this out for yourself? All you need to know is just top to bottom. Basically, you just got to have the, the water off and then put all the placements and then you can go from there. So now the middle, they've got no water going to, down to the middle. So where the, like, the monster was kind of like, I guess, drowning by the door. We should be able to walk across that now. And then from there we can flip the switch uh, on the last one we need to do. Then we can come back up to the middle, flip all that the right way. Uh, maybe not that one. Actually, uh... Yeah, I need to do that for the time being. Oh. This one needs to do it. Because I, I can't get to the middle without this. And we do it again. Oh, dude, go away. Don't be breaking my concentration, man. I love, I love puzzles. I love puzzles so much. Not all puzzles, though. Some puzzles go over my head way too easy. Or I overcomplicate them. Ones like this are just, I don't know, really like. I really like the ones we got, I kind of, I, that's the best way to explain, like matching things up. If that makes sense. Like, I remember it was like a Ratchet and Clank, there was like a little laser pipe puzzle, which I always thought was really fun. But this shouldn't connect to the middle, I'm certain. Uh, actually, maybe there's a little. I mean, that's like the lowest it can be. 
Yeah, we can walk across that. Yeah, that's fine. So now we can get across here. And then we're going to set this up. I'm going to grab... Ooh. Find the chest. I'm going to hit the pots in a second. So we need to do this. Oh, do I need to change that actually? Oh, no. I have to turn that one off. Hang on. Oh. Can't have the water going into it yet. Because that way, if I do that, I can't get back. So we'll turn this back there in a second. Just need that clear. This one faces there. Fantastic. Let me put that one back. So it's, it's fine to do that one now. Might be fun to do the other side as well, then we can just do the middle. Two more times. Right, so that's now in there. Cool. And let's... Do we do the other side yet? Hmm... I could do. So I'd easily get across. So then we do this one. Three times. And then one more time. Then do the first puzzle we did again. And then put the water through the middle, and that should be enough. Unless this is enough, but I don't think it is. Just double checking the water's flowing in from there. It's flowing in from there. And now we need the water flowing in from the middle. Which, to get back from the middle, we go through that side. See? Job done. Easy. So I need to get the water back over there. Almost done. Then we get healed up, save it, and go take on aim one. Which hopefully won't be a difficult battle. <laughs> Go for all this like puzzle just to get wrecked by a boss, that would be embarrassing. Right, so yeah, we do that side first, don't we? Then we come back. Whoop. Ah. Oh. Try to avoid a few battles, and once we defeat Eamon, get that rep up, and then we go capture a bunch of monsters around here, get all the B ones, we get multiple B ones, and then we can uh, do some fusion. Hopefully, have a B team. Go take on the C tournament, the C mausoleum. Banger, man. Absolute banger. Don't know how long it takes us to, to finish Eamon, and it depends what happens after. We'll probably do the tournament at the end of this episode. We've been going, what, an hour and a bit? Not too long. And we go back. Oh, whoa, whoa! <laughs> the 
want to fight you. Does this game got repels? Because repels would be really nice. And you can just like, avoid the monsters by running around. But sometimes they've got big hitboxes. But that should be perfect. All the water flowing down. And we can now go down the middle. Is it all set up? Yeah, look at that. There you go. That's looking good. Unless I've, unless I've missed something and then it's a bit wrong, but... Water flowing down everywhere. Wait a second. Oh, what have I missed? Oh. That water flowing in. Uh, forgot about this. <laughs> Need that back. And then we're done. For a second I was thinking this one wasn't connected to the one down below, but it is and we can just jump across and then, then we're back on the right track. Nice. Bang a puzzle, man. See? Done. That was fun to solve. Alright, so let me go get healed up, and I'll see you guys back in a sec. Alright, we're back. Nice and healthy. Let's go take on Amon. Please don't be too difficult. I feel like our Omni heal is going to be way too OP for you. Unless you can shut down my healing, that's going to suck. You are all in fun fettle. Now it would seem my plan has failed. I never expected you to use the sands of time. But explain to me one thing. I thought you despised humans. What shame could be greater than joining forces with one? You murdered me! Pushed my friend to the very brink of ruin. What has been the point of all this, Armin? <laughs> you are merely pawns. Pieces I manipulate for my own lofty purpose. Nadiria is about to gain a new ruler. One who will change the world utterly. Now, before I eradicate you once and for all, allow me to show you something. Well, see a few familiar faces. Those stone golems all have one thing in common. They are elves, cursed to take such pitiful forms. In destroying them, you have played a crucial role in the demise of elf kind. Oh, how decidedly devious! How perfectly unprincipled! You're the lowest of the low. What have we done? Now, my friends, as you may know, the greatest honor of any good pawn is sacrifice. Consider this your punishment for sullying the era of the one true ruler with your vile presence. This is the era of Armin. Damn, Almond pretty dark, but it's not the era of Almond. It's the era of sorrow. We're gonna absolutely destroy you, son. Right, let's start things off by going for bad medicine. And then attack ya. Oh dude, this bad medicine medicine, the amount of times we miss. Landed it once and it was so good, and now 
Cannot land it again. Oh man, that did so much. Oh no. This battle, I feel like we're gonna be missing. Oh my god, they're massive. Either, either they're massive or my saber cat's just very tiny. <laughs> it might be the ladder, but. <laughs> oh, that's fine. I've got no more bad medicine. Oh man. Alright, uh, let's just see if we can lower your defense. Then we'll do wisdom after. Missed again. Not liking the look of this. And the good thing is we're staying pretty healthy. Regardless of everything that's going on. You missed your attack, nice. Oh no. That stunned me. No, I think I'm good. Yep, miss again, sweet. Honestly, this battle could go a little better, I'll be honest. Bro, I need to cure the silence. Wait, no, yeah, it's still there. Alright, uh... I need you to be able to just heal everyone up. Oh, Omni Heal, where are you at? I need you. Thank you very much. Oh, you just got missing. These accuracy decreases are just. Oh, so frustrating. Right, uh, what to go for, what to go for. I think I'm just gonna put that on you so you can just not miss. Wait, no, you don't anymore. Uh, let's put it on you. Oh, nice, 216 damage. Oh, you're dead, okay, cool. Kill him, oh, you put asleep, sweet. My dude can buff my team. He can put enemies to sleep, and he can heal everyone to max HP of one when one turn. That's just oh, insane. Yeah, stay asleep, stay asleep. All right, uh, that's kind of fine. I guess I'll just get an MP. Oh, frenzy state, nice. Is it weird to like know when they're gonna go into frenzy state? It's just like they're gonna do it after a certain amount of time. All right, you're dead. Fantastic. Now just aim on. Yeah, boy. And again. Guess I can just keep attacking. Honestly, I feel like we'll be good. You ain't gonna do much to me. And if you do, I'll just heal up. And we'll just keep smacking you down. Nice, your attack's down. Oh, yeah, we got this in the bag. <laughs> Let's go! More like one of our, like, if, if Fright Night doesn't get frenzied or someone else, to, oh, okay, that's a lot. Yeah, we can get like six turns, or six attacks per turn. That's actually so good. And Omni Heal comes in in a second. Oh no, I want Omni Heal off because... Ooh, I will uh, fix that in a second. Oh no, we're good, we're good. Maybe I can go for like magic for a second. I think I might mm, change the team a little bit. Because all these decreases really suck. Maybe we can do more damage if we switch out. Obviously, I'm just gonna switch out a healer. Keep them in, just uh, use our B team. Alright, bring you in. 
bring that new snowbird in and then bring you in. I haven't used the Iron Maiden yet, but I'm kind of curious to see how they're going to play. Oh no, I switched the wrong one! Oops. Didn't mean to get rid of a healer, I'll switch the healer back in a second. Although, I mean... Uh, I'm going to go... Bring you back. Do that. Alright, now we fight. Yeah, boy, that Omni heal! Oh, zero damage. Nice. Didn't think you'd do zero damage. Let's try and Maiden out. She's so tiny <laughs> compared to the big one we had. Sorry, we, we, had, we saw. That absolutely wrecked me. Oh, that might be out of poison. Fence up, sweet. Let's go all about because we can just like keep attacking it. Eventually, it's gonna go down. Every little helps. Not only here was just it's just so OP. Like you just because the. the the ability we got where we just keep getting MP back every turn. It's just we could like just infinitely omni heal. We're never gonna never gonna die. The only thing I'm worried about is that potentially you just go frenzied. Just gonna put these back. I was going to recover the MP. More like a MP recovery that does everyone. Fences up. Ooh. Just doing like good damage, man. Oh, zero sweet. I got fires. I'm gonna go max MP. Maybe I can do something. Oh, okay, okay. It's fine, it's fine. I think some of them battles we're just gonna have to. Oh, frenzy state, nice. Just keep going. Like, he's not gonna do much to us. We ain't gonna do much to him now. We're just gonna. Eventually, we'll take him out. It's gonna take a while. But. It's gonna be a long fight. Oh. It's a little scary at times. Nice. So many attacks per turn. Omni heal. Thank you. I want to say he's got to be close to death, but the fact that we're not doing much damage makes me think he's probably got maybe like a thousand HP left. But at least it's beatable. Good thing like we're not in this like situation where we're not getting HP and we're just trying to deal as much damage as possible before we die. We can just keep doing this forever and ever and ever. Ideally, we'd kill him soon, but... It's fine. I wonder what he did like for my... Was it like the... Does the... the uh, I must, the stats must stack, because the amount of like damage we're doing now compared to the start is insane. We can get a crit in. Oh, a crit would be so nice to get right now. Like 20 damage. So I keep holding my breath. Every time I see the attack going, I'm thinking, this is it, this is it. Come on. 
Oh, 118, nice. Let's see the cat back to doing normal damage. Let's see because it's got like no debuffs. Just don't debuff me now. Bounce, okay. Yeah, there you go, Supercat is back to do normal damage. Woo! That was a long fight, but... 36,000 experience, nice. Woo, man, that was good. So our rep's going up, so I can go get some B-Ranks. You have broken the curse. Thank you. Who are you? I am the Queen of Elzetta, the ancient elven kingdom. The ancient kingdom? Elzetta? I was the circle of caprice in its entirety, transformed by Armin's curse. He did that to you? But why? We elves have the power to manipulate spatial and temporal dimensions. In Elzetta, we succeeded in condensing magic to create two kinds of crystal. To control space, we made Travelite and Chronocyte to control time. It's just like my pendant. Armin, overcome by an insatiable desire for this power, placed a curse upon my kingdom. One day, he marched his monster army into Elzetta and attacked us. They took what they came for, our Travelite and Chronocyte. When he was done, Armin dragged Elzetta deep, deep beneath the ground. I remember my grandmother telling me stories of the lost elven kingdom. She said that our ancestors had created crystals of immeasurable power. You are our savior. If you seek a reward, Merely name it, and I will make it so. You wish to be taken to Randolfo the Tyrant? In that case, I must create a new piece of Travelite for you. to travel to the upper echelon of the Circle of Conquest, where Randolfo surely awaits. But now, I must replace the home that the monsters here have lost. By 
the power of Chronosite. I will turn back time and restore this land to its previous form. This is farewell. I pray you may find peace wheresoever your journey ends. Alright, okay, so, I have some, uh, some, oh, some grinding to do. Oh, you go to, like, can tell about different altars, that's cool. Alright, let's go back to Rose Hill Tower. So we've got the new travel light, wait. Oh, dude, I can't, I love seeing all the travel light, I said, just, like, going around, but the giant fairy lady, elf lady, just reminded me of, um, the great fairy from <laughs> Legend of Zelda. <laughs> so... It's all massive. Alright, let's go put this travel light in, and then I think... I'll do some fusing, some grinding, some scouting. Make sure they're ready, because I think the next bit is probably going to be the end of the main story. Can you hear me? The Zenith Dragon! An event of great import is taking place. Look. You are in fine fettle, my lord. Ah, Amon. You were all a fluster. What happened? <laughs> I, I am merely excited to present you with a most exquisite gift. Behold, the secret of evolution. Those who wield its power may transcend the limits of all that is natural. I would be honored if Master Dolph were first to try it. Should he do so? Its immense strength would ultimately annihilate him. Am I wrong? You hoped that he would destroy me before the power consumed him. You are clever, Amon, but perhaps not as clever as you think. Besides, we already obtained the secret of evolution without you. So, would you like to peer beyond nature's limits for yourself? To generate such power, that's impossible. Behold, the supreme secret of evolution. I would be honored if you were first to try. Dolph! the supreme secret of evolution, you would be unstoppable. Then we could finally exterminate that little mistake of mine. 
I'm already unstoppable. I don't need any tricks or contrivances. I'm coming for you, runt. I'll pound you into mush! Spying on me, are you? If it's my head you want, come and take it. That is waiting. The supreme secret of evolution. Not only does it allow a greater level of control, one need not destroy oneself in using it. Should Randolpho wield it against the human world, it would result in the total extinction of life. You must put a stop to your father. Only you can do this. The final battle can't be far off now. I'll give him a smack in the kisser myself. Come on, let's go pay him a visit. Shall we feast on meat and mead, on treats laid out before us? You know the place, so do I. Our secret banquet. The finale is almost upon us, my brother. Which future will you choose for us? Oh, damn, the supreme secret of evolution. Ooh. Okay, but yeah, we are not ready for the final showdown. I'm going to go unlock it, just make sure that, you know, nothing else happens. But I want to make sure that we are proper prepared for this. And then I think there's a little bit of post game as well to do. Which uh, obviously I'm going, to, I'm going to try and do. But yeah. Oh, the final showdown could be next. Turn to Rose Hill. Yes. You know what some games are like. It's like, oh, the final showdown. You go to it and then something happens and there's not actually the final showdown. It was the final showdown before the final showdown before the final showdown. <laughs> well, let's uh, put this travel light in. Wee! Ah, oh, looks so sick. Right, so we are going yeah here, but we are not gonna go just yet. Right, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace. <laughs>